Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Cosmina and I'm making beauty videos. And in today's video, we are going to try a bunch of products from KKW Beauty. I purchased a lot of things in the past few weeks. And by the way, welcome to my very first video of 2020. Can you believe it is 2020 yet? I don't. But we're gonna try KKW today and I haven't applied anything on my skin yet. I was just kind of want to try to talk to you a little bit about what I've been starting to use it using lately. This is still in, I'm still in the trial. I want to do like a 20 days trial thing. And I am trying this kit right here from Tatcha. This is the best seller, I believe it's called, and um, has uh, the deep cleanser which absolutely love this thing. I just cleansed with this one, right? And um, I am gonna use this thing right after it. Three mists. And then after that, I decided to incorporate more steps into my routine, okay? So right now, I'm using Sea Kill and Hyaluronic Acid Complex Rejuvenating Skin Serum from Vitamin C Beauty. I'm using this serum right now. Three drops, three, four drops of that, and then I just kind of push it into my skin. Ah, love it. L -l 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 love it. <laughs> anyway, and then after that, I am applying Tatcha the Water Cream Moisturizer. And then after this, I am applying an eye cream. I have a bunch of eye creams, but to be honest, I don't have one that I like that much. But out of all the ones that I do have, this one is the best one. This is Olay Eyes Illuminating Eye Cream. Right here. And I started using this tool better um, every time. It's much better when I do it with the tool than just actually do it with my finger. With this side, you can push in um, serum, you can push in oils or whatever you want. And with this other side, the smaller side, you can push in eye cream. And I totally see a difference when I do that because basically you you're moving your blood around and it's just kind of like it looks much much better and smoother when you do that so also if you suffer from a lot of puffiness under your eye or something like that this is the thing to go to and and also if you have like let's say really dark circles under your eyes i love this tool all right, and after that, at the end, I'm applying a little bit of oil. So I'm applying a nourishing oil from e.l.f. I'm gonna go with two things. So I'm applying this, and then I'm just gonna push it in my skin. And then at the end, I'm applying some antioxidant booster drops, still from e.l.f. And I love this thing. It is really, really nice because it gives your skin a little bit more boost. Uh, I love to give that extra love to my skin. So after all of this is done, we're ready to go to our try-on, right? Um, I'm going to use the Touch of Skin Silk Canvas to prep my skin as a, as a primer. Well, we're going to use the, the Urban Decay Naked Foundation. I have this in S1 and N. And we are going to apply this all over my skin if I still have some in here. Because as you can see, I've used it. I've used this thing a lot. Put it on, apply it on with a, a brush. A Morphe brush. Okay. 
So how were your holidays? Uh, what did you do? How was everything? Mine, I gotta say, it was pretty, it went really fast and really quick. I did work a lot during this holiday. Um, yeah, I mean, it was my very first year working in retail and it was crazy. I was so tired every night. It's been, it's, it's, it was pretty nuts, you know, and then, um, I didn't have a lot of time uh, to spend with my family and and even I when I had the time to spend with my family I was too tired to do it so it it was a little bit fast it was a little bit rushed it was a little bit crazy but I did have overall I did have a, a nice time um my husband and I, we went to see his family for Christmas and um, had a lot of fun with my nieces. And then for New Year's, we went out to a restaurant and to a Brazilian steakhouse. And we, we had some fun on that, on that night. And that was it, you know, nothing else. But we are getting ready to go for a vacation which is a very a much needed vacation and i am so excited i am in, oh you have no idea how excited i am this is the best best trip we're ever gonna take because this is the trip of our dreams okay this is the trip and um we always wanted to go to tokyo japan all right uh, that was one of our things that we always talked about and we said we're gonna do it, we're gonna do it, we're gonna do it. But because life is a bitch and always there's something else that you have to do, we were never able to go there and actually do it, right? So this year, I was like, before Christmas hit, I was like, can, what do you think if we just kind of go to uh, Tokyo? Um, right after holidays, because I'm saying right after holidays, around the 13th, because that's my husband's birthday, so I wanted to have something special for his birthday going on, so he was like, okay, sure, I'm game, so I'm like, okay, let's do it, let's not think about this, let's just do it, I'm gonna take time off from my work, you're gonna take time off from your work, and, uh, we're just gonna go for it so that's what we did we have everything booked everything it's done and i am excited i am counting the days i only have like a few more days until we're getting there i'm gonna film a little bit over there and uh have some uh, some i'm hoping a very nice video to share with you guys about that but uh yeah i am uh Pretty stoked about that. So now that we're ready to go to concealer, we are ready to go with the actual video, which is KKW Beauty Concealer Kit. I, I bought this kit because I really want to try it. I want to see how it looks like on me, man, right? And I got mine in uh, in the shade 5, I believe. And it's, uh, it came with this card that says conceal bake and brighten and i tried it before i have some mixed feelings about the old three products because they come in three well four i guess five these three and then two brushes this one and another one this one okay so these um and uh i have some mixed mixed feelings about them but i want to show it to you and share it with you right so let's apply the um, concealer i first day i applied a lot and it was like i was so white in my eye it was a bit crazy all right so now i'm like careful what i'm doing i'm trying not to do a lot of craziness so I'm also gonna use her little brush right here to push this thing around so 
So keep in mind this one dries down really fast. So when you apply it, make sure you start blending it right away because if you don't, it's not gonna look cute. Okay, you you must apply it and blend it in really fast because otherwise it's just gonna dry down and you're not gonna be able to do it anymore. So I'm applying it with this brush I always shows in the tutorial or you were supposed to do and it looks really nice. Like right now, it's, look at the difference, huge difference, right? It looks really good, absolutely gorgeous. And I love the color, the color, it's a really nice one. I think this is the perfect color for me. It's really, really pretty and all that. Now, let's do baking, right? Because I'm going to do it just on this side so you kind of see the difference between not having it done, right? And then we're going to do the KKW with this one and this one is in bake. So we're gonna leave that right there while we're trying to put it on this eye as well. All right, so I have them all both baking right now. And while that is going on, I wanna try to play a little bit, right, with her KKW Mario uh, palette. This palette, it's absolutely gorgeous. The colors, oh, to die for. I absolutely love how this thing looks like, okay? So I am gonna take one of the, whatever it's called, I don't know. I am just gonna take it and just play with it. The third shade, I'm gonna leave it on the top screen so you kinda see it. Top row, third shade. And just kind of blend all that in. This is just a gorgeous color to put in your crease. And this works for like, you can just add that and then do your eyebrows, put a little bit of mascara and you're gonna go. I mean, that is just, look at that. A gorgeous, it blends like it's crazy how well it blends. Like I don't need to put any effort at all. This thing just blends by itself. And the color is just gorgeous. Right, right there. And then I am thinking to go, I, I really wanna play with that blue. <laughs> I. I swear, I just kind of, I want to play with that blue. It just calls my name. It says, Cosmeta, put me on. And I'm like, okay, I'll do it. <laughs> I'll do it, okay? So I am just going to take a little bit. And oh my God. Oh, yes. Oh my God. That's in blue, okay? Mm-hmm. It sure is. Oh my god. What do we have here? Wow. <gasps> that is cool. Alright, I'm gonna leave that right there. I'm gonna put a little bit of the lighter shade right in here. There we go. And I'm just gonna blend this in. And I'm using everything with just their brush, right? I'm just gonna blend, 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 blend this blue as well, a little bit. Yeah, and at the end, I'm gonna put this like darker red right here. Just kind of have that, just a little bit of and a color right there. And keep in mind, this is with only one brush, their brush. And 
that is perfection that looks amazing i'm gonna add just a little tiny bit of more of this blue that i still have on my finger just gonna have it a little bit popping just a little bit more but man i love this okay let's take this thing off and then i'm gonna go ahead off camera and apply on the other eye So this is what I'm saying that I have mixed emotion about because this powder is very drying. Although it's a very mist powder, it's like very thin, very pretty, right? But it's very, very drying for some reason unknown. It is very, very, very drying. So I... Honestly, I would not bake with this. Like, I would just apply it a little bit because I tried both ways, right? I tried baking with it and I tried just fluffing a little bit on top, right? And um, it's definitely when you just fluff it a little bit on top and you do not bake with it. Because when you do bake with it, it is drying. It is drying your under eye and it does not look pretty it does not look pretty okay so i'm gonna go and um do what i did for this eye on this other eye and come back all right so i'm done with this other eye now let's go and see how this whitening brightening powder looks like okay it's very hard to open my god come on girl all right, so this thing, be very careful because when I applied it for the very first time, it was crazy. So don't apply too much. <laughs> that's, that's, that's my thing to you. Um, I'm just going to get it. I'm going to use their brush again, but just a tiny little bit, okay? Just a little tiny bit. And then apply that because this is blinding whitening, okay? So you don't need a lot on your brush, just a little bit. There you go. And that's the thing, it's like as bad as the other and drying the other powder looks like. This one actually makes it all better at the end, and I just don't understand how it looks. I don't understand how it works and why, but I would not apply that. If it was me, I would not apply the, the baking powder at all, and just kind of go with this thing on top of it, just a little bit, and just be done. Honestly, that's what I would do. So I'm going to put a little bit under here as well. And a little bit on top of my nose. And just look at that. That looks so good. I love it. I love this brightening powder. This, it's gold. I mean, it is gold, okay? You don't need, you don't even need actually a, a highlighter, to be honest with you. Because this, it's a brightening powder. And if you don't feel like the highlighter, especially the one that are very glittery, you don't like that that look on your skin this is absolutely amazing because this one does not show your pores or doesn't make anything look bigger at all it actually covers everything and keeps it all really nice and cute and supple okay so this it's gold i love this thing a lot now if you're still here let's try something for my brows and i just bought this the other day from uh, from the from the drugstore and this is elf gel and powder eyebrow kit and this is in the shade medium brown so i want to see is this gonna work for me or is not gonna work for me i don't know i am very particular with my brows i i have a 
some standards, okay? <laughs> Let's say like that, right? I know my eyebrows. I know how I want to have them done. I know how I want them have them look like. And a lot of the products that are being loved by a lot of people, they don't work for me. And I do not like them. I don't know if it's just me or just, I don't know, maybe I'm just crazy, but I don't like them. So let's see what this one is going to do, okay? Oh, wow. It's pigmented. Okay. Ooh, I see you. Ooh, I kind of like it. All right, there we go. Now I'm done with that one. I'm still going to apply a little bit of eyebrow gel because I do not want this to go anywhere. And it seems to be a little bit runny, so I'd rather be safe than sorry. So I'm going to go with my Blink Clear Eyebrow Mousse. For my under my eye, I still want to try a new product as well, because why not? We have KKW here, but it's not all about her, okay, honey? Um, I have this L'Oreal New Nouveau Infallible Pro Lasting Waterproof Pencil. So I want to see how this is going to play. You know, because I have this blue color on top, so I can put this on the bottom. And also in my waterline. I do like how it applies. It's very, very pretty. You know, it's not... Um, and it's also very easy to apply, and it's very creamy. Very creamy. So I like how that applies. We'll see how it's going to wear down. But I do want to add a little bit more, maybe this rusted um, brown under my eye. I am going to go with a little bit, I want to contour my face, right? Because we need a little bit of contouring. Yes, honeys. So, we're going to go with... Um, Anastasia Beverly Hills with the Cappuccino Powder Bronzer. And I love the shade. And I also love this bronzer. I love this bronzer. This bronzer is really nice. So I'm going to get one of the Morphe brushes. I'm just going to go in town a little bit right there. And it complements my skin tone so well. And it also just kind of glides on your skin really nice you want to go under here and just kind of bronze all this area so we can look a little bit thinner and slimmer yes <laughs> and then I'm gonna do the nose And we are done bronzing, right? And I want to add a little bit of the mascara, KKW mascara. This has been my go-to for the past month. I am in love with this mascara. I've been wearing all the time. I'm almost done with it. And I need to go and buy another one because I love this mascara. Look at that. Why would you need fake lashes when you have this product on? Look at that. Mm. <laughs> All right, now what are we going to do? I'm going to apply, I'm thinking a blush. Let's see. Uh, what do I have around me? I think I don't have anything because I just organized my makeup, you guys. I'm going to make a video and show you how everything I organized. I put it all away, so on my table I only have a few things, and the only brush that I see 
around. I think it's the only, only oh no, I see one. There you go. I see a Milani one. And then I wanted to show you that I have this one, NARS from Orgasm from NARS. It's a mini one. I don't like it. I don't know why everybody's so crazy about it. I do not like that one. So, yes, I have Milani, and this is in Blossom Time Rose. I love this one because it kind of gives just a little type of, just a little bit of hint, not much, you know, and it's really, really pretty on the skin. All right, and now let's do lips, right? We need to do some lips. And I have two KKW products right here. I have the KKW Lip Liner in Nude 2. I featured this in a different video as well. I love, love this color. There you go. I love this color. This color looks so good with my complexion. It's crazy. Sometimes I just apply this and I put a little bit of, um, of um, lip gloss and I'm out the door. But today, I want to do it right, and we're going to apply her lipstick, the one that I do have, which is in 2.5. It's not the best color, to be honest with you. I'm not really in love with this color, but we're going we're gonna to do it. <laughs> and there you go. It looks more like a 90 combination, the lipstick the lips like this that's why I don't like it that much and also the lipstick I don't I just I don't know it's not hydrating enough I I I feel like it's a little bit drying I don't know not a big fan of the lipsticks formula but the lip liner it's freaking amazing the um eyeshadow palette it's gorgeous the brightening powder it's super blinding okay and i also i do love her i do love her concealer as well it is i i don't know if it's one of my favorites yet i still have to play a little bit more with it but i do enjoy her concealer i have to say that i like the concealer i like the brightening powder I do not like the baking powder at all, um, but um, everything else, yeah, it's it's definitely go for me. And I am glad you stayed with me all the way until the end. I know this was a very long video, but I missed you guys. I'm so happy to be back, and I will keep you informed with more and more and more products there are going to be a lot more palace reviews and eye looks so thank you so much for being here subscribe like this video if you liked it and i'll see you next time with another video